UPS is cutting 12,000 jobs. UPS announced Tuesday that it will cut 12,000 jobs as part of a bid to save $1 billion costs. Managers and contractor positions will make up most of the layoffs. News channel sparks outrage over sexist editing of female lawmakers' image. An Australian news channel has apologized after broadcasting an edited picture of a female lawmaker that enlarged her breasts and exposed her midriff. The digitally altered photograph of Victoria state lawmaker Georgie Purcell appeared in a Nine News Evening Bulletin Monday after she criticized the local government for rejecting a ban on duck hunting. I endured a lot yesterday. But having my body and outfit photoshopped by a media outlet was not on my bingo card, Purcell posted on X Tuesday, alongside the original and altered photos. Note the enlarged boobs and outfit to be made more revealing, she added. Can't imagine this happening to a male MP. She says she gave birth to a child after a Lyft driver raped her in 2019. Now she's suing. A Florida woman sued Lyft earlier this month, alleging that she was raped by her Lyft driver in 2019 and that the assault resulted in the birth of her third child. The suit is the latest in a string of sexual assault allegations involving the company. Lyft has pushed back on the allegations in the lawsuit, telling CNN in a statement that the alleged assault took place during an off-app ride hours after an official Lyft ride with the same driver. The company also said it only became aware of the alleged incident years after it took place. Plaintiff Tabitha Mean stated that what she had hoped would be a short ride back to where she was staying after a night out quickly became uncomfortable when the driver asked her to sit in the front seat, and then began complimenting and inappropriately touching her, according to the complaint filed January 10 in California Northern District Court. GM said the strike cost it $1.1 billion. But it could post a record profit this year. A 46-day strike took only a modest bite out of General Motors' earnings for 2023, and America's largest automaker said it expects profit to bounce back to near or above record levels this year regardless of the higher labor costs, forecasts of weaker car prices and other headwinds. The automaker said it expects 2024 adjusted earnings of between $9.8 billion to $11.2 billion, which could top the record $11 billion it earned on that basis in 2022. The company reported adjusted net income of $1.6 billion in the fourth quarter, or $1.24 a share. That's down 46% from a year earlier, partly due to the $1.1 billion cost of the strike, most of which came in the fourth quarter.